Hi everyone, Susanna, the co-founder of the Armoring Arts and uh, yeah, I have about 25 years of experience within spiritual spirituality, personal development. I'm an absolute geek in in discovering myself and the human potential. And um, well, long story short, came across the Armoring about 13 years ago, and it was absolutely life changing in many ways. Um, learning more about my sexuality, about sexual healing, about opening the body on a deeper level. Um, yeah, it was so profound that I actually decided I wanted to start to learn it. And then later on, I met Dan and we started to teach it together and now training others to become the armoring practitioners. I think for me, the armoring is about coming closer to myself and the truth of who I am and being uh, willing and able to face whatever is in the way. And I cannot do that by myself. <laughs> it is an impossibility. There, there needs to be someone who holds space for that truth to be faced and felt. And, and the most direct way in is through the body. And um, I, know, I know these three guys since uh, I know myself pretty much <laughs> many, many years. And I can say that there are so many trainings out there and so many fantastic people doing this work, but you will never find such a combination that you find here. And this is why I can say, and I have done several different trainings and I assist in other trainings. And um, this is one of my favorites because, because of, the, of the many different approaches that, that Sana, Matt and, Dan, Matt and Dan bring, that is very, very unique. And, and as they said also, that this is, is becoming like an industry a little bit. And it's really difficult to find the people who are integrated, who have done the work, on themselves, who have the experience and who have the courage <laughs> to face the truth when it arises. And these three are magnificent. And um, and I trust them fully with my heart. Uh, I And I think this, this is why this training is so unique and, and deep and transformative because all of them have done the work <laughs> and gone through the darkness of the soul many times for themselves. So they know exactly what everyone is going through. They have seen it all and they have experienced it all. And I think that is like, for me, the most important thing uh, for me to be able to trust someone in this. And also, I think what is unique also that you get to experience so many different people and working with so many different people and receiving uh, also work from so many different people. And all of those are incredible opportunities uh, to learn about yourself. So it's not just a, a training where you will take, take the tools with you that will support you to become a, a practitioner, but also um, an inner journey of transformation and learning about yourself that is really, really special and held in a way that you will not find in, in many other spaces. And it's difficult to say how it happens because it's it's so experiential. Yeah, I mean, you didn't know what I was gonna say, but this is what came, so. Well, thank you for, for those words, uh, uh, Susanna. Uh, Peter is my name. Uh, and yeah, I thought Heine put it brilliantly, but um, for me, I think um, it was really the personal journey that was also the, the, the main thing. I, I um, you know, maybe when, you, when I went into it, I don't remember exactly, but like I wanted to add things to my, you know, toolbox as a practitioner and learn a new method, but, but uh, I was... I was hit by, uh, you know, facing myself, and and uh, and that was the main main part for me, just to uh, to do that and to dive dive in and and to um, to face whatever uh, came up. And uh, I think what what has already been said by Heine, but but for me, the combination of you three uh, is is very unique uh, the personalities that you are but but also that you can you know you're very you're very human and you show yourselves and you can 
you know, um, uh, even disagree and, and, you know, be very human in, in, in showing yourself. And, and that was, and that is for me very unique and uh, uh, gives so much uh, depth and strength to the, to the training. And, uh, and um, yeah, and really to also for me to, to give something uh, to put in is, is to really, if you're going to do the training, to take it as an opportunity to really show up for yourself and to, um, uh, to really commit yourself to that uh, and, uh, and take the opportunity to be triggered, mirrored and all of that. Um, and for me, that was really profound and, and uh, I really grew and um, that's why I'm coming back because I think this, um, this is really um, transformational uh, environment to be in. So I'm really grateful to be part of it. What was the main outcomes you had on your personal level? Are you willing to share like the main two or three? Does it feel okay to share that? Yeah, sure. Uh, see if I can uh, pinpoint but um, yeah for me I mean one main thing for me is for example that I, I hold back I, I uh, sort of have had a self-worth issue and, and uh, um, have looked down on myself and not uh, or, oh no it's not good enough and, and that was one one thing that came up quite a bit that uh, I just uh, need to step up and, and, and um, give out what I have because it is enough and, and um, to be mirrored in that and to feel that and, and uh, to see myself in that I hold back. And uh, that was one main part for me. Um, and, and also to just to dare to speak, uh, because of also sitting to observing is, is another part of, I observe. And I, I like that also to see other people and then to observe what's happening in a group and things like that, but also to, to participate, to take part, to speak up so that I involve myself. Uh, it's another part. And uh, yeah, there are more, but <laughs> those are the ones that come to me. Um, I went to your course and I have to say it was life changing for me, as you know, and I really can recommend it and I recommend it to so many people and I still do some exercising, but and um, really shaking and yeah, it changed my life a lot. So I really thank you a lot and uh, how it was, but I also thinking, should I take another one? Or repeat the one or add on. I'm, I will not ever be a practitioner and practice. So, what's your advice in that? Should I take a next step on it or just repeat it or just be happy as it is? Yeah, I don't know. It changed a lot so much, and I want to take further steps to be more alive. But it's uh, it's changed so much, and uh, I mean, uh, I got a lot of of my drinking problem. I got to work, and yeah, so. Yeah, I also had a training with you, and that was also it. Really made me way more free, and and also it gave me so much trust in life and in myself, and um, and yeah, especially about this question. Uh, it's it was so elaborate, liberating that it's it's not about sex, sex, but it's. It's way deeper. It's way more about intimacy, um, about yourself, and and yeah, being you know in your hands and with the other practitioners, um, holding the space for each other was um, magic. So yeah, would uh, recommend it to everyone. 